Hello and a warm welcome to ITV4's live coverage of Formula E from Punta del Este, Uruguay. The future, I suppose, is a big question mark for you. There are fewer F1 teams than ever. Where does that leave you? What's the future hold? Yeah, it's, it's a really tough time trying to get into Formula 1 at the moment. Well, Lewis Hamilton only managed 16 laps yesterday afternoon. He had a problem. They couldn't actually fire up his engine. I've just found out that engine was also the engine that they used in Hungary, which caught fire. So they managed to repair it. Anthony Hamilton basking in the sunshine here in Monza. Good to see you. And uh, you're probably pleased to be here to watch your son, aren't you? Yeah, absolutely. It's, uh, yeah, it's nice to be in some sun for a change. Good news. Sebastian Vettel's just been there chumming it up with John Surtees. He's just at the back of the Red Bull garage. Uh, I don't think he'll be going out. Daniel Ricciardo is, though, which is excellent news. You got the job after Eddie Howe left to go to Burnley. Someone had come to you and said, right, 11 matches from now, one loss. You'd be happy with that, wouldn't you? Yeah, I would have, yeah. You've played football at the most competitive of levels for 15 years. You've only had two months managing. Which do you prefer? <laughs> at the moment, I'm enjoying managing. This small town, just a few miles from Italy's Adriatic coast, is the home of nine times world champion Valentino Rossi. Growing up, the roads around Savulia were Ross's racetrack. The quiet country lanes, a picturesque backdrop to a young boy's dream. Here, the multi-million pound sports star is amongst friends and family. This is a place where superstar Rossi can be simply Valentino. Well, I couldn't let Steve get in and all the fun without having a little bit myself, so I took a slightly different guided tour of the track. Oh my goodness. And that is honestly one of the scariest things I've ever done in my life. Ooh. What was well our done. top speed? Done about 160 odd. Yeah, 160 odd. <laughs> you see, that's fine. I tell you what, that was ridiculous. 